everyone, welcome back to my channel, Apples and Tiaras. So today I'm going to be doing a mommy related video and I'm going to be doing a what's in my diaper bag video and I'm really excited about this because when I was pregnant I would watch tons of what's in my diaper bag videos to get ideas of what kind of things moms would carry in their diaper bags and since becoming a mom almost three weeks ago I have really learned what I need in here and even though I've only gone out with cash only a couple of times I really do know what exactly I need. I just wanted to show you guys the diaper bag that I'm carrying, the diaper bags that I have, and what's in the diaper bag. So first I'm going to start with the diaper bags that I have because I have three diaper bags. I know it's a little bit excessive, but I got a little excited when I was buying them and uh, one of them was a gift, so I'm just gonna show you guys all the diaper bags that we have. This is the diaper bag that we're currently carrying, and it is the backpack diaper bag. It is from Land, the one on Amazon. I'm not exactly sure, but if you type in back backpack diaper bag on Amazon, you're gonna find this one. It looks like this, it's black and gold, and it has the backpack straps. It also has this strap, so you can just grab it by your hand and it has all kinds of pockets. So this is the one that we're currently using only because we did go out for an outing where we needed kind of to have our hands free. And so this one was really, really nice to have. But I am gonna show you guys the other two diaper bags that we do have. The first one is Scott's diaper bag, and I actually got him this for Father's Day. And this is a tactical baby gear diaper bag. And I got him this because Scott is gonna be mainly doing all of the childcare when I go back to work because he is home, home Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. He is gonna have cash by himself for three days out of the week. Um, and I just thought it would be cute to get him a diaper bag. Now, he, we haven't really used this one yet just because we've been together um, with the baby. But he can also use this for a gun bag, um, a duty bag when he's not using it as a diaper bag. So we really like it because it's multi-use. And then we also have a Kate Spade diaper bag because you guys know I love Kate Spade. And this was actually a gift from Scott. We went shopping a long time ago like I think we got this when I was like maybe four or five months pregnant but it was 75% off so I think I got it for like $70 but it's just this black Kate Spade diaper bag it has the uh, black strap here and then it does have the shoulder strap and then inside I think these are for strapping it on the stroller but they ha it ha comes with these straps so I think you I don't really know what these are for but it, I was carrying this in the beginning when uh, we first had the baby but I really like it. I just needed the backpack one for right now. But this is also a really great travel bag. So if I were to go on a trip with Cash, I could pack this for um, him. Just put all his clothes and stuff in here. I was using it as like a toiletries bag as well before I had the baby. So um, like I said, these diaper bags are also very versatile and can be used for other purposes. So that's why we have three. Okay, so now I'm going to dig into this big thing and just show you everything that I keep in here. And I didn't really go through and organize it. The only thing I did was throw my purse my purse in here, which would normally be in here if I was using it. So I'm just going to go ahead and start with the front pouch. This diaper bag comes with this front flap, which has three insulated bottle holders, but because I am strictly breastfeeding, I do not need these for bottles, so I've put all my little, like, toiletry items in here, things that I might need. So in this one, I just have some natural nipple butter by Earth Mama. I really like this stuff. Not only is it good for breastfeeding, but it's great for putting on baby's chapped cheeks or um, Cash had kind of like a chapped chin his first couple weeks of life just from breastfeeding. I'm not having any issues. I don't need this for me, but I do carry it for him just in case he gets chapped or anything. So I really like this. You can get this on Amazon. And then in the second one, I have these little diaper bags. I've seen these everywhere on YouTube. Um, you'd get them at Target. I think you can get them other places, but they're basically like kind of like a doggy bag. Sorry if you can hear my dogs barking in the background, but they're kind of like a doggy bag for diapers just to keep the diaper smelling fresh if you're at someone else's house or out in public and you don't want to throw the and you have nowhere to throw the diaper you can just pull one of these bags out we haven't needed to use these yet but they're in here and then in this side pouch I have some hand sanitizer from the honest brand I also have some organic 
healing balm. This is basically like Aquaphor, uh, but it's the Honest brand and it is organic. And then I also have the Honest face and body lotion in here. Just if I need to change him, we always put this balm on his tush um, at each change just so that if he does poop, it doesn't stick to his butt and um, we can easily wipe it off. It's just kind of like preventing a rash from happening altogether, which is great. We also use Aquaphor and we have a big one of these for at home too. So that's what's in there. And then I also have just in this like front flap, I have some Q-tips just in case I need to get a booger or something. And then I also have some disposable nursing pads. I use reusable bamboo ones at home. So I just have those just in case I were to leak through or something, but I haven't really had that issue yet. In this side pouch, this is actually meant for wipes, but I don't really keep the wipes in there. Um, I've been keeping my Milk Snob nursing cover in here, and I like these because you can put them over the car seat to keep germs out, to keep wind out, and you can also use them as a public nursing cover. Uh, I just have the black and white stripe one from Milk Snob and I really, really love it. And then in the other side pouch, I don't really have anything, but I might keep my phone in there or like lip gloss or something that I really wanna get my hands on in there. I might keep that in there. In the back of this bag, this it has like a little, little zipper pouch, which right now my phone is in. Um, and that's a really nice place to keep it because it is easy access, but you could keep like your wallet in there or like, you know, lipstick or deodorant or whatever kind of like a mommy bag and then back here it actually has an opening so that you can get to the bottom of the bag right now my nurse or my changing pad is there but like if you kept your diapers at the bottom or like clothing or anything else that you know is at the bottom of the bag you can open this flap and just reach into the bottom so you don't have to like dig and pull everything out so now I'm gonna get into the big pouch and I like how open like wide this thing opens up I really really like that so the first thing I'm gonna pull out of here is just my purse and I'm just carrying this little black basically like clutch purse and I don't really keep a whole lot of stuff in here I have like my car keys I have some more hand sanitizer I have the baby's hairbrush in here because I don't know if you guys have noticed if you follow me on Instagram um, but Cash has a lot of hair, so I keep my hairbrush in here. Um, I have some pads because newborn baby. Um, some like lip glosses and my wallet. And then I keep these hair clips in here. Not only to clip my hair back, but to hold my shirt. Like if I'm nursing in public, I like to like pull up my shirt and clip it to the top so that it stays up so it's not falling down. But I have two of these in here, one for my hair and one for my shirt if I need it. But that's kind of like all that I have. Now into the bag. I have this changing pad, which came with my Kate Spade diaper bag, and it's just perfect. It, it comes right out, so I'm just gonna use this for everything, but it opens up really big and it's sanitary because I don't wanna change him on like one of those changing, no. Um, so I have this. And then I also have a Wubbanub in here. Uh, Cash really likes the Wubbanub. It helps stay in his mouth better. And he likes to cuddle. He, he is so funny. He likes to use his hands. And he has his hands up here all the time. So the Wubbanub, he likes to hold on to it. And like he will actually hold it. So we have one of those in here. And I just keep it in a Ziploc so that it's not touching other things in the bag. And then I also have a wet bag in here, which also contains a change of clothes. It actually has two onesies, a hat, and a pair of socks in here. And then the bag opens up and it is waterproof. So if he did have a blowout or, you know, an accident, I could put the wet clothes in here. And then he has a change of clothes. I got this on Amazon. I literally, like, searched wet bag. And this came up and it came with a big one too. So I have a big a bigger one that I um, have with like my luggage and stuff to take if we went on a trip just to use for us. So it's really nice and small. And then I have a swaddle in here. This is just a swaddle from Little Unicorn. It's got little buffaloes on it. I use this sometimes um, if I'm changing him. I like to kind of wrap his upper half in a swaddle when I'm changing him because it makes him feel a little bit more secure. So I like to have a swaddle in here or if it got cold or something. And then I also have his little jacket in here 
just for when we go out, I can put that on him if it gets chilly. It doesn't really fit him yet though, that's a newborn. <laughs> Um, and then, so you guys can see, the bottom is empty. Uh, in the side pouch here, I have a couple of items. I have a couple of little uh, towels and then a couple of burp rags. Just in case, I usually throw the one I'm currently using just in the top when I go anywhere, but those are just in case. And then in the next pouch over here, I have a couple of types of wipes. Um, I do have the pacifier wipes. Usually I'm not really too worried. I'll like stick the pacifier in my mouth to clean it off. That's what my mom did with us, so that's what I do with him. But if it fell on a really gross surface, I could wipe it off with this. And then I just have some antibacterial wipes for myself if I'm at a place where I can't wash my hands. And then in this side pouch here, I have all my baby wipes. So I do have a travel size um, doohickey. I don't know what this is called. Got this on Amazon. Just researched travel wipe container. Found this. Um, and it's restockable. So you just open it here and you put your wipes in. And then you just open this up to use them. Which is really handy. And I can put whatever wipes I want in there. And then I also have two travel size honest wipes in here. I get mine at Sprouts. I can't get them at my Target. They don't have the travel size ones. But I can get them at Sprouts. So I do whenever I, whenever I go. And I just keep them in there just in case. And then on this side... I have diapers and uh, we like the Honest brand diapers. He's still a newborn size, um, so they're just really teeny tiny. And I usually keep, I, I just kind of fill the thing before I leave. So I don't really plan like, oh, he uses seven diapers a day. No, I just stuff it full before I go anywhere. And then the last pouch is this zipper pouch here. And all I have in here right now is just some extra white petroleum jelly because he um, has a little boo-boo on his downstairs, uh, if you know what I mean. And um, so we're just putting that on his diaper. You, at home we use Aquaphor because we don't like petroleum jelly. Um, but I just have that in here in case we need it. So, yeah. So that is everything that I carry in my diaper bag for a newborn. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, if you have any questions or um, any other video requests, please, please put them down in the comments below. And um, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys. Hi guys, it's Char. I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching my video today and for supporting my YouTube channel by subscribing. Don't forget to click the little bell next to the subscribe button so that you can see when I put up new videos. I hope you have a magical day.